The history of Jean McCarthy's began uh, actually before Jean. Uh, a Polish woman ran the bar called Julia's. It closed, and in 1963, Jeannie and his brother Joe, who was known as the boss in the neighborhood, uh, opened it back up. Uh, they ran it for quite a few years into the 2000s when they sold it. I think uh, a good fish fry is first and foremost is the fish. We have a, we use a 14 ounce piece of haddock, fresh haddock, and uh, this is a beer battered example. We do it several different ways. To me, the ideal fish fry is um, a big, huge piece of fish, as you can see. Normally, it would be haddock or cod, um, and it also would have all the homemade sides. And usually, there's the three homemade sides, which would be potato salad, macaroni salad, and coleslaw. And then it's usually served on a bed of fries. Um, fish fries are served on Fridays. Um, it's mainly a thing to do at Lent. It's a, with Roman Catholics because um, during Lent, you're not allowed to eat meat on Fridays. So that's how it became a pretty popular thing in the Buffalo area. A beer batter uh, is very popular at Fish Fry because I think first of all we make our own beer here. The beer we use in our beer batter is Irish Red Ale for the majority. It's a nice malty beer so it adds that nice little added flavor. We have also experimented with our uh, oatmeal stout uh, and we try to just, but the, the key I think is to stay with the malty, maltier beers. Gene McCarthy's or Old First Ward Brewing is obviously in the Old First Ward. The Old First Ward is an old blue collar neighborhood, mostly Irish. They were grain sh uh, shovelers, uh, all the grain silos uh, you can see right from the, from the w front window of the bar. There's some really beautiful buildings here. Uh, we feel that the bar is uh, just a very historic place and so we're, we feel really privileged to be part of that uh, reawakening of the Old First Ward.